Hello, my darlings. This is a very real, raw and honest video. And I know that it's always the best thing to do is to share whatever message I'm growing through. I'm going to share it with you because odds are there's going to be a bunch of you who, are, who need this message, who are experiencing the same thing right now. As you can see from the title of this video, I've been focused on the wrong thing lately. And the reason why I haven't been posting consistently is because what I've been focusing on is maybe that idea is not good enough. Maybe that message isn't uh, good enough or I need to use my fancy camera, my fancy microphone, my fancy lighting and edit it all fancy and make it all of these things that are clearly not the most important thing. The most important thing is for me to come on here and share a message with whoever needs to hear it. I know that so many of you come to my channel because, and I do this with my favorite YouTubers too, because they say something that helps me today. They say something that helps me to refocus while I'm on my journey of, you know, working on my mindset, healing and work and believing in myself. So what I was doing was not showing up for you because I was focused, I was too busy focused on how I couldn't get all the fancy equipment ready when that's not actually what matters. And I'm very grateful that I've built an audience where you come to this channel for the message, not for the fancy lighting or camera. Correct me if I'm wrong, but it'd be great to get some feedback in the comments from you to hear why is it that you that you watch my videos? What is the, the common factor about my videos that is the reason why you pressed subscribe? I think I'd really, I'd really appreciate hearing that at the moment. Um, so yeah, so that's one thing to share with you all on this video is that I've been focused on the wrong thing and maybe whoever needs to hear this, maybe if you've been focused on the wrong thing lately and, and it's been a good reason why your brain is telling you is it's your brain is telling you that it's a good reason why you're not ready yet why you shouldn't post it yet why you shouldn't start that thing yet why you shouldn't do whatever it is that you've been procrastinating the thing that you hold most resistance about which is as you know usually the thing that's actually going to completely rocket your growth in whatever area you want to grow so whatever story I've been telling myself or you've been telling yourself as to why we're not ready to just freaking show up and deliver the gift that's inside of us. Let this be the moment that we stop holding back. <laughs> the second message I wanted to share in this video is about the fear of success. Often we talk about the fear of failure. The reason why we don't put ourselves out there or don't start that thing or don't take that risk or whatever is because we're scared of failure. The funny thing is we can be scared of failure and also sometimes some of us are scared of success as well. And I shared a really powerful video. I'll put the link in the description of this video to this incredible rising YouTuber who I'm supporting at the moment called Ense. She has a great channel and she shared this video about the three signs that you might be scared of success. And I related to all three signs that she was saying. Okay, so I know some of you, you know, you've seen my journey of getting to 100k subscribers. And I just wanted to keep it really real that don't be like, I used to think that people who had these plaques and had the audiences, blah, 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 like they had all their limiting beliefs figured out. But the, the, the truth is that we're all human and you never know where the tests are going to come. You never know where your brain or your limiting beliefs are going to kick in. <laughs> and since I've been since I've received this plaque, I've I've got new limiting beliefs come up. Ones where I put too much pressure thinking, oh, well, I have to be this fancy, perfect YouTuber now. So creating a video just like this from my phone isn't good enough. You know, there's always it's always interesting to watch where your mind holds you back. And so I've been witnessing my mind holding me back, resisting uploading something, but it's selfish. The selfless thing to do is deliver the message, however it looks, whether I'm with hair like this or hair, whatever, 
you know, makeup or no makeup, fancy outfit or no fancy outfit. Like none of that matters. What matters is our connection. What matters is it's sharing this message with you and making a positive impact. So for those of you who want to make a positive impact, this message is for me and for you as well. Let's just freaking do it already. Let's get over the illusion that everything needs to be perfect. I think school and a lot of society taught us about it has to be 100% or it's not good enough. It has to be perfect or it's not right. Or maybe in your life someone's laughed at you when you made a mistake or someone teased you for not being whatever. And without realizing it, sometimes we're hold, like we're holding on to that years later, maybe even decades later, and limiting where we allow ourselves to go for fear of being laughed at again. So it's just interesting to kind of witness these fears, these irrational fears that come up to realize that we're all human. We're all imperfect. We all have our ups and downs, our weeks when we feel like it, our weeks when we don't feel like it. So within the context of us being a perfectly imperfect, flawsome human being, how can we just show up the best that we can every day, knowing that our best is good enough. Even not your best is good enough. That takes me on to the final thing I want to share on this video about manifestation. I was listening to this amazing woman, Beth Allen Hayes, or Hawes, can't remember how to pronounce her name, but she's really powerful. She's got a podcast called Spiritually Rich. Go and check it out and check her out on Instagram. Let her know that I sent you because she's a really lovely woman and she talks a lot about manifestation and she was talking in one of her recent videos about a common mistake that we make with personal development where if we it's great to always be working on becoming the best version of yourself but if you're looking at the version of yourself that you currently are through a lens through eyes through a perspective where you feel that you're not good enough and you're not ready for what it is that you want then you are here holding yourself here and so you'll always also be holding what you want away from you because you believe that this version of you isn't ready for it and so the great truth of manifestation is actually to become to not only to become but to know that you are ready for it now to prepare yourself sure but to also know that you don't have to be this instagram filtered version of yourself to live a life with more of whatever it is that you want more of. So that's me on this raw video. Let me know in the comments what resonated or if any part of this video gave you the boost that you've been looking for or the sign that you've been looking for or the message that you've been needing to hear because that's what I came on here to do today. Not to be fancy with intro music or outro music or anything like that. I, I know you guys like that too and I will get back to adding that too but I just wanted to overcome my own personal hump and lead with some value so I love you I appreciate you so much for being part of my journey thank you for being patient with me and growing with me and yeah being patient through all of my imperfections because I'm human too I really appreciate those of you who reach out to me and say things like it's okay Lucy like you're allowed to live life you're allowed to plan your wedding and do all of those things and not necessarily be super consistent with YouTube. So I'm not going anywhere. I will be back soon. I'll give you an update about the wedding soon as well. It's all systems go, which is really exciting. But yeah, love you all. Thanks for being here.